you. So, what happened? It wasn't the first time he called for me, you know. I knew what he liked, and I believe he liked me a lot. And he always gave me more money than my usual price. No, wait. What we want to know here is not your prices or anything else, big girl. We want to know how he died. Okay, like I was telling the doc, at the moment, you know, he was about to, to get off, well, um, then the next thing I knew, he clutched his chest with his hand, and then he collapsed, and that was it. What can I tell you? Yeah, all of the symptoms of a heart attack, Inspector. The autopsy will surely confirm it. Uh, you will have my report by tomorrow night, okay? All right. Good. Fine. If you don't need anything further, I'm going to slip the carcass into the cloth and be on my way. And me? Can I go? If you've told us everything you know. <sighs> what else am I supposed to say? Look, the guy had a heart attack, and that's it. Is that all? Are you sure? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hang on, hang on. Before he died, he said uh, Rosebud or Frozen Bud or something like that. I don't frozen know. Frozen Bud? What the hell does that mean? Oh, hell, I don't know. You're the cops. Yeah. He said Frozen Bud before dying. Is that correct? Mm-hmm. And he said nothing more? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, my dear Sonia, I owe you a favor, don't I? And to call you first before any of your newspaper colleagues get the scoop, and to tell you that Victor Henri Chen, well-known playboy, is dead, that's a great favor, isn't it? Yes, indeed. This is a great favor. Thank you. Right. So now you're free to go. So on you go in your little way, okay? So I can continue interrogating the witnesses alone, okay? Good. So you're really sure that you have nothing more to tell me? Look, I told you everything. He put his hand on his chest, he collapsed, and I had nothing to do with it. Can I go now? The death of one of the most notorious playboys on the planet. That should sell some newspapers, baby. And better yet, we are the first weekly to announce it. That calls for a celebration, don't you think? <laughs> Come on. Let's drink to the golden... the golden scoop. Well, now that you mention it, speaking of gold, boss... Let's talk money here. I think you were saying something about a raise. A fucking raise? You really have the knack to spoil my rare moments of pleasure. I already told you that I can barely meet my Fair expenses enough, as it is. Hand. This scoop means money. If the circulation increases with the next issue, we can see about a little bonus. How's that sound? Yes, but... And besides, you have a real big bonus at your disposal. Right away, if you won't. <laughs> oh, yes, I see. You have some nerve, boss.